All right, I'm going to show you guys how to have Python talk to an Arduino to display whatever text we send it on an LCD display. So uh, this is the tutorial that you'll need to go through to set up the uh, LCD with Arduino. Uh, you, you really don't need this. It's just for uh, the contrast of display, brightening it and darkening it. And uh, go through that, get this set up and we'll just be using the base sample code to do this but there's a few things that we have to do in Python so you can see right here I have my Arduino hooked into my computer via USB and then this LCD display um, hooked onto this breadboard so first thing we need to do is load on the code uh, onto our Arduino so let's launch the Arduino IDE, go up to File, Examples, then down to Liquid Crystal, and then Serial Display. And let me close this one, and close out that. And so we have the code here. We just have a setup, uh, what pins we have, and then uh, we're going to communicate at 9600 and uh, we have if serial available delay 100 milliseconds we'll clear it and then while we have data we'll write it out to serial display so let's compile this so command R will compile and then command U will push it to our board alright so now that that's done, um, I'll hit the serial monitor. We'll bring that over. And if I type in hello, hit enter, we can see it output on the board. And we can see this dimmer here. The contrast works. So now we need to get Python set up. So the first thing we need to do is uh, get Pi Serial. So uh, if you already have build tools set up, all you have to do is sudo easy install Pi Serial. Alright, and that will install this serial uh, module for you. So I already have that installed. You go ahead and do this and then we can jump into the code. So vim um, tutorial.py and the first thing we need to do is import serial and now we need to uh, actually we need to import well we'll leave that out for now and I'll show you the issue that I ran into so we'll just say uh, serial or actually we need just we'll have port equals to serial dot serial and now we need where our device is hooked up to and uh, we can look in our Duino IDE we'll go to tools serial port and it will show the port here that you should have selected when you set it up so we need to copy that right here so it's dev slash pyyl and then USB modem 441 alright and then 9600 as our baud rate okay so we have that now we need to write a string to our Arduino so we'll say oops port dot write and then hello alright so we'll save this and we'll call Python and then tutorial so we'll look at the Arduino here and I'll run this on my machine and we can see it just went blank and I was having this problem and I just couldn't figure out and what happens is 
when we first make this connection to our Arduino over the serial port, it takes two seconds for it to establish that connection or whatever. I don't know the correct phrasing, but you need to wait two seconds before you start writing to it. So we need to import in Python the time module. And right after we make our connection here, we need to say time, uh, sleep, and then sleep for two seconds. All right. So we'll quit out of this and we'll run this again. And we'll hit enter. It's going to sleep for two seconds, and now we see that it's uh, displaying our message. So the thing to remember is in Python when you're using this, after you make this connection, wait two seconds before you start writing to it. So after we did that, we can do something like uh, message, and that's equal to a list here. And we'll just say my name is Michael. All right, we'll close off that list and let's delete that. And we'll say for word in message. And then we say port dot write and then word. And then we need to do our time dot sleep and we'll sleep for uh, one second and um, that'll be good. So this will go through that entire list and write out a word every second. So we'll save that. We'll go back and hit run here. We're waiting two seconds for initial contact and then we see my name is Michael. And it just runs through that once and we're done. So keep that in mind when you go to connect, uh, wait two seconds after port and you'll be good to go.